go ahead and hit that subscribe button. You know, with you guys supporting us and following us, it allows us to continue to do what we do, and that's make awesome art videos for you. All right, let's get started. So the first thing that we're going to be drawing is our narwhal's horn, and then we're going to build around that. So in order to do our horn, we're just going to do a nice curved line, and that's going to be the bottom. And then we're just going to do a little slanted line all the way up, and then we're going to go to the other side, and we're going to do the same thing and connect it with a point. Now the next thing we're going to do is we're going to be going and doing the top of the head, so we're just going to bring it, curve it down and in, and then out just a little bit, and then stop there. And then we're going to go to the other side of the horn, we're going to go around and down, and then we're going to stop about halfway, and now we're going to do um, one of the narwhal's uh, flippers. And so we're going to just come down, and then we're going to swoop around so it's a little bit curved, just like this. And then we're going to start on the other side, and we're just going to bring that um, down and out. So that creates the rest of our narwhal's body, just like this. And then we're going to do the tail now. And the way we do um, the tail is we just do two leaf shapes kind of connected together. So I'm going to start at that line that is um, at the end, and I'm just going to bring it, curve it up, and then I'm going to curve down. And then from that point, I'm going to curve, go to the other side and do the same thing. So I'm going to curve out, and then I'm going to connect it, and then curve out again and connect it by a point, and that's how you do the fins. And it's okay if they're not the same size, it actually makes it a little bit makes it look more dynamic if they're two different sizes. And then we're going to do the back flipper there, and so we're going to curve it out and then down and have it a little more curved at the bottom like we did with the other one. And now we're going to do the underside of our narwhal, and that is just going to be a nice uh, teardrop or raindrop shape on the belly where the point is um, starting at the tail. Now we're going to give him a nice little smile and then two little diagonals on the end to make him look super happy. And then we're going to go ahead and do the eyes. Now with the eyes, you're going to do a small circle at first, and this is going to be our highlight. So you do two small circles, and then you do an even bigger circle around those small circles. And then we can color in the bigger circle, but we leave the little circle white, and that gives us our highlight. Now it doesn't matter what you're using. You can be using a pencil or a marker or whatever. You can do it this way, but if you are using a pencil and you can erase, you can just do a black circle and then erase um, with an eraser and get that highlight but I prefer just to use the smaller circle bigger circle technique just because sometimes you don't have a brand new eraser that has a nice fine tip so um, this is just an easier way to make sure that your highlight doesn't get lost so now we're going to go to our horn here and we're going to add the details and we're just going to add little diagonal lines all the way up our horn just kind of like a unicorn horn narwhals are kind of the unicorns of the sea and there you go there is your narwhal now, what we're going to do now is we're just going to color them, and I'm going to be using some blues and pinks for, for my narwhal, and you can use whatever colors you want. Now, if you like this video, then go ahead and hit that like button, and if you want to see more fun videos like this, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, and if you want to show off any of your work, go ahead to any of our social media platforms. The links will be in the description below, and you can um, send us one of your creations. We would love to see what you guys do. Thanks so much for watching, and we'll see you guys next time.